Hi, good morning. Welcome to the Legal and Policy Dev Room. Yay. That was uh, Karen Sandler, and uh, I'm Tom Marble. And welcome back for our seventh year talking about legal and policy issues and free software. So uh, we're really excited that you're all here bright and early on a Sunday morning uh, to talk about these topics. We have a full day, which hopefully you will be really informative for you. And with that, let me pass it to Bradley Coon. Hello, I'm Bradley Coon, one of the four co-organizers. First of all, can I get a thumbs up or thumbs down on, does the audio sound okay? It sounds a little bit weird up here. Is it thumb, okay, we got, well, half and half. Okay, about half and half. Um, yeah, I hear, we hear some static. We're gonna be looking at that uh, throughout the day. Hopefully we'll get that fixed uh, and make it sound a little better uh, later in the day. There is a way for us to contact the organizers. Uh, we are really glad that you have joined us. This is our seventh year of this dev room, uh, which makes us uh, uh, one of the older dev rooms uh, uh, now in existence, except for the truly old ones that go back to 1999 when the conference started. Uh, we're very glad that we've had the opportunity to get the big room again this year. Uh, <laughs> we, we do not expect it to be full. The last time we had the big room, it was not completely full. Uh, but uh, we hope that it won't be so that folks can be in here. The theory of creating this dev room was quite simple. We wanted to create a forum that was a place where everyone could talk about legal and policy issues, that nobody was excluded. I had the opportunity to bring a person uh, who will be here shortly who has never been to FOSDEM before, my father, uh, who is going to come see uh, this dev room we've been organizing for so long. We had the opportunity to do some tourism before coming to Brussels. We were in London and we were able to see the music Hamilton, uh, which was very interesting to see in the middle of London, just uh, a few miles away from Buckingham Palace and think of the founding of my country, the United States, and uh, its, uh, its um, yeah, uh, uh, historical relationship with the United Kingdom. And uh, there's a very interesting th uh, theme that goes throughout that show. Uh, that there's talk of the political dialogue that exists in the world and the room where it happens. And sometimes we call this the smoke-filled room. Too often, many of these kinds of discussions happen behind closed doors. I've been in both situations. I've been inside the room where it happens from time to time. And I've sometimes been excluded from the room where it happens. We want to make this room the room where something happens that people can hear and engage. We don't have a lot of time for questions, unfortunately. Because we have the one day, we limited all our speakers to 25 minutes. But we have a nice, huge hallway. The upside of this particular room is we have a giant hallway track outside. You can come in and out, discuss things out in the corridor. Uh, please do go away a little bit from the room so that there's not audio coming in from the outside. But we do encourage that. We do encourage dialogue. We want to see that as part of this event. I don't think we'll have to do, if you were here in previous years, the constant compression. But if we do need to, at one point we may tell everybody to move in. If there's a lot of people coming in, please be responsive to that when that happens so that we can have chairs and use all the chairs. And we've just been joined, uh, uh, slightly tardy Mr. Fontana, by our fourth organizer. And that's how I want to finish up. We are four people that organize this dev room. But three of us are the only sometimes reliable assistants <laughs> To no, the no fourth, no to the fourth, and I count myself among the, while I was reliable this morning, I have at times been unreliable, <laughs> just like Mr. Fontana here. The one who is the most reliable is this man right here. This man was a co-organizer of the Java Dev Room for many years. The free Java Dev Room. The free Java Dev Room, I should say. I assume that everything at FOSDEM should be free software. I just assumed. Uh, don't even need to say it. But... Tom here has worked with us for seven years. Every single year we tell him, oh yeah, we're gonna do more work this year, all of us. And every year Tom does the bulk of the work and we try our best to help him. But I just would like to ask for a round of applause for Tom Marble, our lead organizer. Thank you, and uh, I don't wanna take any more time away from Raj, but uh, what, what, distance, like this? Further away, yeah. much better, okay. I just wanted to highlight, we have a number of great talks today, but pay special attention to the fact that we have our organizers panel at the end of the day, the last time slot, which we hope will be an opportunity to 
engage in an active discussion of all these issues. And well, with that, let me turn it over to our first speaker. Here I am.